I have been discussing, as you know, with Mr. Stettinius, the Secretary of State, with you, Mr. Clayton, the FEA, the War Shipping Administration, and the War Department, the urgent needs of France in supplies and in shipping necessary to transport them to France. We have all learned through bitter experience that our enemies cannot be beaten unless all of us mobilize all our resources, military and civilian. Since the day of liberation, we have actually put France in a state of readiness for active participation in the war. Our gold production has risen, our manpower is organized, we have rebuilt bridges and railroads, our factories are ready to produce. I'm happy that our talks have been successfully concluded. As you know, Monsieur Manet, much has already been done. The President has announced that large quantities of armament will be provided to equip additional French troops. Tonnage has been allocated for the months of January, February, and March to carry supplies to France. It is our sincere hope that in March these allocations may be further increased. In addition, ships flying the French flag will be assigned to this run to the maximum possible extent. We are happy that France is now rejoining again with full force in this common battle, and the French people can count on our full cooperation.